It's really easy to ignore the meta description when you're writing a blog post or publishing a site page, but it's really important for SEO and click-through rates that you write an effective meta description for your organic search results. So I'm gonna show you today my tips on how to write an effective meta description. Let's get started. When you're writing a meta description, you wanna grab the viewer's attention when they are searching for something. If someone's looking on how to write a blog post, think like you're making a CTA or a call to action for your post. Use words like learn, as you can see here, discover, or grab, so that you'll get people to come to your page if that's what they were actually looking for. Provide a solution or benefit, that's tip number two. As you can see here, our meta description says, learn how to write blog posts and get free examples and templates to help you write five types of posts. This makes me wanna go through because I know that I'll be getting something valuable after I click the link. Number three, keep it under 155 characters. This here is what a meta description of 155 characters looks like. You can try SEO MoFo's Google SERP optimization tool to double check. So you can see here, this is what 155 characters looks like. Number four, don't deceive your searchers. As you can see on this page, what I was searching for was how to write a blog post. If I had come through one of these pages to a page on landscaping, I would be very frustrated as a site visitor and I would leave. If you want people to stay on your site, fill out a form, and eventually become a lead, you would want your meta description to match the actual page that they will land on. Number five, keep it specific and relevant. As you can see here, writing a blog post, how to get the draft whipped into shape. These types of things are tangible and actionable things that people can use to determine what your search results will eventually bring them to, so that they will be able to have the best possible experience. So, there you have five tips to writing an effective meta description. It's important not to skip this step because you'll lose out on an opportunity to customize your offer. Thanks again for checking out this how-to. Make sure to check the link and stay tuned for more of these videos.